Mellow greetings, Tubians. We are back in Hisui and continuing with the never-ending Dex Hunt. Well, it kind of feels never-ending at this point, but it's it's awesome. I am thoroughly, thoroughly enjoying this. If you have not picked up this game or have not started to work on your decks, I would strongly urge you to do so because this is just this is awesome fun. It really is. And awesome fun is what we all need on a Monday. Ooh, what's that over there? You think I'd recognize dire shrooms by now, but no, 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 no. That would be practical. All right, so we do have a few kids that we need to grab today. First off, we're going to go back up and get an electabuzz because I forgot about that on Friday, and thought I had one already because I'm a silly Billy. Uh, but for now, let's go find us an electabuzz, and from there we need to. Hunt down. We're basically up to alphas for stuff that we can actively catch. And really, really trying not to get spotted by the um, big guy. Roman, what are you? You're a. Uh, no, Luxio is the middle. Shinx, Luxio, Luxray. There we go. Thank you, Brain. About time you did your job. Alright, so we've got a couple of buzzers about. Mm. And we did not die. That's always good. There's precious little places to hide. As we all know, I am the kind of person who prefers to sneak rather than attack. Oh, hi! You spotted me at exactly the wrong moment, and I threw out exactly the wrong Pokemon. <sighs> That's okay. That is absolutely okay. So it is suddenly getting very dark. I didn't think the day cycles were quite that fast. Adam, please try not to kill it. Thank you. Oh, even better. See, Adam, this is why I love you. Let's try and pick a ball at its head. No, 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 no. I need you to stay in the bowl and stop electrocuting my Sylveon. When did we agree that that was a thing, Electabuzz? Please stay in it this time, pretty please. Pretty, pretty, pretty please. I said please. Ow, you're meanie. All right, Roman. You can't do much to hurt you. the list. I just need to go put Adam back together. Oh, and that got me some points for seeing it use stuff. That's what we like. Multiple things at the same time. Alright, so let's take Electabuzz off the list. Done. And...
Who we got next? We're down to mostly the childlikes and alphas. But we've got a Heracross who wants mourning in the Wayward Wood. Where is the Wayward Wood? Am I? Ah, oh, there it is. Ah, right next to the ancient quarry, which is where we will also go to find an Alpha Gudra, who's who we inform. So, we're going to sleep till morning. Discover that it's snowing. Realize that we don't really care about the weather. Try and there. Excuse me, Professor. We got stuff to do here. Do we already got the ad maker? Yeah, we do. And let's grab some shrooms on the way up. I got almost no hunting time over the weekend because I got just a wee bit distracted by Octopath Traveler 2. It was and is muchas fun. Many, many, many funs being had. Alright, so in theory there should be a Heracross. I may have to do a spawn clearance. Get rid of all those mothams. Is that? Yeah, that's an alpha mothum, I think. I'm ignoring whoever just spotted me. Oh, it's a mothum. Sorry, Mr. Moth. I may have to clear you out to get the hair across I want anyway, so... May as well just hit you over the head now. Sorry, Roman. I know I don't like having to use recoil damage moves either, but... Your deck says you gotta do it. So you gotta do it. Now, is this the whole of the Wayward Woods, or does it go up that hill as well? Which means that's the Wayward Cave. I had something in the Wayward Cave. Ah, uh, Crobat. Alright, so we might try... And head up. Not seeing a change over... Probably about to throw some big nasty rocks at me. Cause that be what gravelers do. And a stuck key. No sign of a hair across. Can I go up this hill? Um, some crow gunk. This might be where the goo tree is. <laughs> mm, sorry about that, guys. Now, the goo tree is an alpha spawn, so it shouldn't be too, too hard to locate. Be nice, Toxicroak. Oh, there it is. Oh, she's a beacon. And I'm not 
not seeing any grass closer to her. I think we're going straight for the Ultra Ball for this girl. Taking some heavy risks. I don't know why it just ran all the way over there. It had me dead to rights. Oh, hi! I threw that before you spotted me. Ah! I do not want to fight you and two Krogunk at the same time, please. Are they croak croak? No, they're toxic croak at this stage, aren't they? I always get that backwards, I don't know why. Stop walking straight towards me. Yeah, everybody likes a good berry nom, don't they? Even the biggest, toughest of alphas. Glad to get her off the list. Alright, Hasui and Gudra off the list. And we still need to try and find Heracross. Morning, day, evening, Wayward Wood. Which is down here. Tis where we started. Sorry. Where did I get the hiccups from? I have done nothing to be hiccup worthy. Carefully slide down the edges. It's another Mothum. I don't need Mothum. Don't need Paris. Parasect. Just need to find me a nice little hair across. Which means I'm gonna need to clear out all of these Mothum, aren't I? Well, curses.
Which one of you spotted me? Oh, you. Oh, yeah, you're a really bad choice for that. Okay, this should be interesting. Um, I feel like that's a little imbalanced, guys. Three of you, one of me. Well done, Marcus. You were amazing. I was hoping to catch some for deck sentries, but you know, if they're gonna make us kill them, we're gonna kill them. Really? Paris, you just watch me wipe out your big brother and two of his buddies. But you still want to have a go. Alright. Alright, hopefully I don't need to take out the alpha to get this area to respawn. What we are going to do though is run into that cave. See if we can track us down a crowbat. Crowbat? Yeah, crowbat. And then we'll come back. Oh, no, ancient quarry. I'm in the wrong spot. I thought this was the wayward cave, but it's not. Houston, where's the wayward cave? Here, I'm guessing? Yeah. Alright. We will come back shortly. Maybe. <gasps> we found the Heracross! And the space time distortion. That's bad. And now it's probably run away because we've had to do this fight. <sighs> Inconveniences, these. Inconveniences. Alright, it's got its back to us. It turned around. Silly me not to expect it to extend further south. That's all right. Still gonna get ya. Yes, gotcha. Hey, apparently I've already caught one though. Why was it still on my list then? Huh. Interesting. But it's done and definitely off the list now. Alright, so we are headed to the Wayward Cave, which conveniently is right down here. Let's try not to die. We're sneezing. All right, we're in cave. Let's go. Have I even been in here? I don't remember. <laughs> and I've got it marked down on the map, but oh, is this the one that what's his face led us through? The conductor. And we were uh, 
chasing down a melee. This way. That's a Golbat. We're looking for a Crobat. And that's some kind of fishy. Barboach. Okay, there he is. He's hoping it can't attack me from the water? Oh yeah, it can. It really can. Let's try hiding in the wisp well. Can't see me, big fishy. Alright, given the potential level, we are going to resort to using an Ultra Ball. Fishy is evil. It's gonna be the death of me. <sighs> See how you go against Roman. But we don't want to kill you. Uh, Roman? Oh, there you are. Ow! Roman, we want to injure, not kill. That's okay, because you're dead. Huh. I don't like this guy already. You're not immune to poison. Okay, all right. Now, Marcus, just tap it. Just, 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 just a little nibble, okay? Good boy, Marcus. a way to heal itself. <sighs> Let's get out of here before that fishy kills me. Crobat is got. I love it when a plan comes together. Alright, so that's Crobat off the list. Do, do, do. So, for the non rare spawns, as far as I'm aware, we are down to that Golem that we missed, and that Glysaur that we missed. Wrong button. So, Boulder Roll Ravine. Let's start with the Golem. Um, and then I've just got the Awkward to Catch Rare Spawns. There it is. Such as Cherim, 
Elikid Chingling, who I haven't seen in the wild. And that's it, actually. What spawns here during the day? Oh, we've, we've got Misdreavers during the day. Interesting. I might have to check some Dex entries. And Haunter? And I feel like you guys are all nighttime types. Oh, we've got an Alpha Graveler running around. Perfect. Where is my Alpha? Baldor. Oh, that's right, he's down here. At least he should be. Um... Let's make all them. Huh. Maybe he's over this way. Could have sworn he was uphill though. If it was going to be over here, I would have spawned in by now. Okie dokie. Well, that was kind of pointless. And Glassor is at the Primeval Grotto. So we might just zoop back to Moonview Arena. That's yeah, this way. Is this sacred plaza? Yes, it is. All right, we've got a slim chance that we'll run into the chingling. that we need just randomly so I can't imagine they're very large what is that that is a vault orb you are not worth an ultra ball sir There's another vault hole on the other side. There's one there. A sadly not shaky tree. Another alpha lux, right? Exploding on somebody who just wants to be your friend is mean. Yeah, not getting any love on the jingling. Okay.
Another alpha graveler. Did I annoy somebody in a previous life? Now, if I recall rightly, he was sort of tucked into a wisp. So he was sort of uh, tucked into a corner. What is that? That is a very odd graphic. In this general direction. Away from the smaller of its kind. What is that? Oh, it's a tree. Okay. Apparently somehow over the weekend I have lost all my subtlety. I just want to get the closer and the golem and then I'm done. Now he's seen me. Apparently nobody. No, 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 You see nothing. That's okay. That's all right. Big boy didn't see me. So, we can take down this little one. And... We can hope that nobody respawns too fast. Yes, 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 yes. And we're out of space, so it's time to go back. I actually don't mind too much missing out on XP candies and stuff. I don't really use them all that much. I just... I don't know, I like to do things the old fashioned way. Keeping it real, as it were. Do kids still say that? Alright, let's craft a couple more of these. Because we are going through them with all these alphas. Rest until morning. Cross that glyssaur off my list. All right, let's go see if we can find that golem. He was at the Boulder Roll Ravine. So we want to fly to the Moonview Arena. And we really want to hope that it's actually spawned in this time, please. Pretty please. Ooh. 
Oh, should I check for the chingling? I feel like I should be, because... Rare spawns are what they say on the box. Found it. We've already caught Rhyperia. I, I don't feel like a Chingling requires an Ultra Ball. Just good quick throw. Yes! Chingling, you are off the list. Do, do, do. So, Elekid, Gollum, and of course, the ever elusive will probably get its own seven episode streak. Cherum. Do I have a ripe area? It's not showing up on my list, but. Oh, I'm really, really, really not sure. I oh, know there's two of you. I'm not going to argue with that. Although apparently I can come back here for a Chingling and Chimeco Fest whenever I am ready. There's a few of them about. I haven't seen that many babies on a spawn before. I suppose they're not starters. And the uh, Sinonian starters do seem to be the most painful option available. Alpha Gravel is still there, so I'm willing to guess that the Alpha Golem has not respawned. That thing has an incredibly slow spawn rate. Alright, let's go. Sleep a lap. Sleep until night. And again until morning, just to give us the double shot. Alright, we'll give this one more try and then I think I'm going to call it. I can't believe we found chinglings just like that. Okay, you guys become bronzors or bronzongs, yeah. During the daylight hours. Except when you're randomly still mischievous regardless of time of day. No big sturdy fellow here. Huh, 
There he is. Hey there, little fella. Been looking for you. Please tell me you didn't just bring a friend. You absolutely just bought a friend. Oh, no, 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 no. No, self-destructing is not on. <sighs> Sorry, Adam. Cad, avenge your fallen comrade. Make with the soggy. I said soggy. I did not say you could dodge, Mr. Graveler. Come on, cat. There you go, that's my boy. <sighs> now I just need to get the heck out of here. And there we go. Alright, so everything else on the list here is going to be part of the rare spawn hunting video when I edit that together. So we are ready to go back to the village. And in our next episode on Wednesday, we're going to start work on the Alabaster Icelands. Our last segment, at least till we get to the post game. Yep, we caught oh thirty species. I would like to return to the village, please, boss. I needed to show a reason of mischievous, didn't I? And go see Baggins. Do I have to have it in my party to show it to her? About your request. I know I've got one here somewhere. There you go. You know, people are afraid of Mistrevis because of how it apparently wails at night. But getting a good look at it like this really gives me some fresh perspective. Look how it billows and sways and flows. Wait, that's it. That's what I'll do. I just lit up some charming hairstyles and an enchanting new palette of colours. All thanks to you and Mistrevis here. Come by any time to try out my new ideas for yourself. Well... Will they be free? I like free. Now what do you want me to find? Hmm, that's not right either. It needs a special something extra. But what? Oh, nice timing, as always. I could use your help coming up with some new hairstyles. I've hit another wall here. I bet I could get inspiration from a different Pokemon this time. A Pokemon like, yeah, Curlia. I can't remember how it looks exactly, but I'm pretty sure it has a real distinct style. If I could study one up nice and close, I'd better to get me past this block. If you manage to catch a curlier, bring it here so I can have a look, okay? And let's just finish that straight off. Um, again, I know I have a curlier. Yeah, they say Curlia just loves to dance. 
I kind of get it. That feeling when your hair sways around you while you're dancing, it's the best. Actually, yeah. That's the sort of hairstyle I want to go for. Now, how to get up the hair the right way? Hmm. And where should it be let down? Oh, I've got it! That's what I'll do! Girl, I owe you one. Thanks to you and Kelly, I've got ideas for some new hairstyles. And new colours. Like no one's ever seen. Come by and try them out for yourself. Alright, let's get a haircut. We can afford it. We can afford it. I want to see what all these funky new things are. Okay. Now, one of the fun things with this game is you've actually got to click on the option to get it to show up. I kind of like that. Yeah. Yeah. Ugh. Uh... I almost always end up with twin twin tails. I Yeah, that's definitely fancy. I kinda like the formal updo. Braids are what we've got at the moment. Also sorta of like the Super Saiyan. We'll stick with our braids. And we're crimson, violet, clementine, peach pink, ash blonde, periwinkle, ash brown, flax, turquoise, gold, slate. Yeah, we'll stick with the crimson basically. Periwinkle? <laughs> Ash brown eyebrows. Uh, again, we'll stick with the black because it's nice and visible. Yes. That's exactly my old style. I look no different! Yay! I'm sure you'll have another quest for me eventually. But for now, we are saving. We are saying our fondest farewells for today's episode. Hope everybody had a good time. I know it was a bit more of a low energy one today, but that's going to happen when we're on the hunt. And in our next episode, we're going to head back to the Alabaster Icelands. And maybe progress the story and catch a few more dex pages. We will see what happens. Until then, this is Rodentia signing off, and I will catch you in the next one. <laughs>